Hey, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you, thank you, thank you for episode six. I believe we're, we're getting up there in the numbers. We're getting up there in the numbers. I think it's six or seven. I'm, I want to say seven. Episode seven of Seven Days to Die. Thank you guys for watching. This is amazing. It's crazy because it's episode seven of Seven Days to Die, and we're almost on day seven. Probably going to end up at day seven at the end of this video. So seven, seven, seven lucky numbers. Hopefully, we have a good day on some Seven Days to Die today. All right. So last episode, pretty much where we left off was we were pretty much making our base, the foundation of the bases pretty much there we already have like the whole uh, pillar beams to support beams and everything like that like all of the blocks in a nutshell are pretty much placed the only thing left that we have to do is uh add a little bit more defense in the front of course i want to add the sludge turn right here but the main thing we need to do is turn all of these frames to the actual wooden blocks along with uh going ahead and, and filling up pretty much everything that we want to fill up here um i do gotta watch out for the stab stability of the base because uh, i've had it happen too many times in the past where I, I would build a base and i would be building boom 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 block 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 next thing you know pink but it's too fast bro i'm building too fast and the whole thing starts collapsing before we do that, I think what I'm going to do is just get a nice little foundation. I'm not going to work on the roof. We're not going to do the roof today. We might do the roof today, but I'm definitely not going to do it right now. And I want to upgrade everything because I have a theory that if you upgrade the blocks and you get the stability thing, the only thing that crackles and breaks is the frames. If it's like a legit block, it won't crackle and break. But I believe the frames will crackle and break. So we're going to be working on that. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get this get this show in the road. Okay, I'm back soon. Okay, I'm, I'm I knew I was uh, I'm, I'm gonna do all this and that. No, okay, I'm back. Okay, it's been like five minutes. Okay, I'm back. Okay, so I I, I figured I I did a little bit of research, not a lot, but a little bit. Let me guys know. Let me know what you guys think of you know what I'm about to show you. So this is pretty much going to be my main source of defense here. Um. So the zombies are going to be crawling this way. So I pretty much put fences all the way around. Now, the only part they're going to be attacking me is from here. So I'm not really worried about this little corner fence here or this corner fence here. I might actually remove that because of cop zombies that shoot acid at you. So there might be a little bit of changing in the future for here. Because if I stay in here, they'll be able to shoot at me. Since I can shoot through this and I can shoot through that, right? Which also means that they can spit at me through there. And then I'll be over here thinking I'm safe. And the next thing you know, I get hit from a cop zombie, which is bad. So I might change that in the future. But the main part of the defense is this. So I pretty much put down two hatches here, which I thought was pretty nice. You know, two, two nice little hatches here. And then right here, I got two of the frames. So if they destroy one frame, they got a whole nother frame that they have to go through to destroy. So we're going to test out what is this guy real quick. So he's hitting it. Boom. Hitting it and everything. And I could just knock him out just like that. And he falls down all the way to the ground, which is perfect. Now he has to go all the way back up bro all the way back up or what is he hitting what is he hitting whoa 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 sir oh that's not good oh that's not good we got to do something about that oh we got to do something about that i don't know uh, if they come down they're oh ooh, let me oh ooh, that's not good that's not good let me think about this let me think about this. Okay, guys, I figured out something crazy that I did not know in the game. So right here, as you guys know, I've been using these like slabs or plate blocks, but they are extremely weak. That's why the zombie was able, one zombie was able to kill that thing in, in an instant. And this entire base is built off of these things. It's not this part right here where I have the actual blocks, but still this entire base is quite literally, I think there's a plate right here. It's quite literally built off of this. So like if we hit this right quick, 25. 25 durability this block right here is 500 bro 500 so i think what i'm gonna do i'm going to replace each and every one of these with these which are just the uh what are, what are, what are these I, I believe these are called the uh the slabs plate no these are the plates so instead of the um whatever this is i don't even know what this is i don't even know i don't know what this is i forgot but we're gonna replace them with the plate because the plate also has 500 so instead of 25 we're gonna do 500 because that that i'm glad that i caught that before Horde night that would have been nuts okay that would have been crazy. Okay, so everything's pretty much been replaced, which is really, really good. I'm glad that I caught that. I do, you know, this isn't bad, though. This doesn't look, you know, absolutely horrible. I wish there was a thinner block than this that I could use that I could, like, walk through. Because I can't walk through these, unfortunately. The plates I could walk through. I know these are the plates, but I don't know what the other plates are called. But they're going to be we're gonna be putting them plates. Okay, plate, plate, plate. But I wish I could walk through them. I feel like there's a thin one out there. I just, I didn't do, like, a really good search. You know what I mean? I just picked the block. I was like, oh, that has 500. Let's use that instead. You know what I mean? So we're going to be rocking with this. It doesn't look bad either which is you know which is a plus at the end of the day which is really really good but the testing product the testing phase is going to be when we actually get to test it to see if it's actually good or not one dilemma that i ran into we have eight wood okay that is a major dilemma 
that is not a good dilemma to have. Basically, we can't upgrade anything. A absolutely nothing. I'm glad I spent the last bit of my wood upgrading the foundation because if anything down there would have broken, that would have been it for like everything. So we're probably going to have to, I don't know if there's wood at the base. So I'm going to check the base to see if there's wood there. If not, we're just going to have to break down some trees. That's just, just the bottom line. We're going to have to break down some trees, do some farming, do what we have to do before day seven comes. And they're killing something. Something just died. I think a zombie just died over there with by Mr. Cougar guy. Uh, that's I've never seen that happen before. I, I thought they were friends, but we're gonna go to the house real quick. See, we got some wood. If we do, that's a good thing. If we don't, then we might as well just get to the farmer, my friends. Might as well. All right, guys, it's been a while. It's finally day seven, 10 o'clock in the morning. I've mined enough wood where I have a stack of wood and, and, and then some. As you guys notice in the bottom left hand corner, I got the little death icon on me. I did die. I died to a bear while trying to mine wood. I was mining wood and bear head just came out the leaves. So, like, I got scared, okay? But we, we died. We definitely did not kill that guy, but at least we're not infected anymore. That's the good part. Um, but yeah, we got enough wood for, I believe, for us to pretty much fully deck out, or not really deck out, but fully upgrade our house to like the wooden version, so these planks, you know, for, for, for wood or whatnot. Um, we're gonna do that, and I also got myself some, some of the cobblestone that it was at the, at the main base. Um, and I'm going to put that at the, uh, the main entrance or the main, like, fighting points of our, uh, of our base for this horde night. Um, and I think we should be good for the most part. After that, I do want to try to raid some houses to get some bullets for my, uh, for my pipe machine gun. I have literally no bullets for this guy. Um, the only alternative is trying to find a pistol or some equivalent to a pistol for the 9mm ammo. Because I do not want to do melee all the time here. I think having some type of ranged weapon would be good. If push comes to shove, then we're just going to have to go back to the crossbow. Uh, or not really the crossbow, but just the, the, the bow and arrow. Probably use up these iron arrows and whatnot. But that's pretty much the game plan. I'm going to go ahead and start upgrading some of these and everything get the cobblestone ready and i'll see you guys once that's done all right guys for the most part i've pretty much gotten finished with the whole upgrading of the base obviously there's still some frames here but i think we'll survive throughout the seven days um without these frames being upgraded i don't think any zombies are going to be hitting these but just in case just in case they do we're going to head you know just upgrade like the the lineage you know what i mean all the way from here to here that's pretty much all we need you know what i mean if if this stays if everything breaks down but this whole entire thing stays that's all that's all i need to survive i think so we're gonna keep it just like that and i need to go it's 1400 okay we don't have that much time until the seventh day so i need to go and i need to freaking uh i need i need to raid a house but i'm gonna show you guys everything that upgraded all of this is now cobblestone as you can see uh all the stairs down there are cobblestone the foundations and everything are cobblestone um and for the foundations at the top i made them out of wood and that's pretty much all i've upgraded so far um, I was thinking about putting like a nice little fence in front of the turret there just in case it gets hit. I'm not sure how the turret situation works. Like does the turret have health? Will the turret, you know, get destroyed if it gets hit too much? I'm not sure how all of that works out. Uh, and I'm not sure why she's hitting this foundation. But if I had a gun with bullets, block, 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 she's dead. You know what I mean? So, I mean, we're right here and she changed her, he, she changed her little whatever she want to freaking be aggro on. So, I think we should be fine for the most part. Um... I'm hearing a lot of bad music, so I think a mini herd horde is coming my way, which is fine. We're leaving anyways. We're about to go to the quest location. We're not actually going to complete the quest. The only reason why I want to go to the quest location is just for that double lootage. But we're just going to be rushing through this and trying to find ammo or trying to find a gun. That's our main That's our main purpose right now, okay? Ammo or gun, ammo or gun, we definitely 100% need that, okay? 100%. Very important. Okay, there's a lot of fog going on. I can barely see anything, but this seems like a little decent house. Um, I'm assuming the big chest is up there. We're gonna probably go in from the bottom unless we build like a ladder system or somehow to get into that rooftop there, which I, we don't have any wood on me. I didn't bring anything, so we're just, we're just oh, the fog cleared up. That's nice. But we're just gonna go ahead and regular regular way. We're not gonna, gonna really worry about any zombies for the most part unless they're, you know, an immediate you know immediate like threat to us uh, we're not really going to worry about looting anything in here i'm already familiar with uh, how this entire base loadout is so i think i'll be able to pretty much go through this fairly quickly the only thing that i'm not very familiar with is if there's an upstairs or a downstairs portion uh, of this house we're going to go upstairs because i believe everything is probably upstairs everything's walking as well which is pretty easy to deal with yeah definitely everything is up here so we go all the way up here and then we just got this guy right here with the lootage that was fast that was fast take that guy out it's probably gonna be a while for the zombies come for us we got some food there which is actually kind of nice 
hopefully there's something in there that we can actually use uh i don't think the zombies are going to be able to get to us there's not really like a walkway way for them to get to us for the most part which is really good so we're just going to destroy this hopefully there's something here we can use i highly doubt it yeah there's there really nothing much of anything up in here we're gonna head and learn this cut through the ashes for blah 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 do 10 percent more damage to cold or burnt wood that's actually kind of nice i feel like that would be really really good for late game other than that yeah i don't really see a reason for us to stay in this house any longer probably just go ahead and activate the quest more than likely just to um just just for the house to reset i don't think there's much of anything in here looted wise that i could really utilize so i think we're just gonna go home make our way past these zombies before they wake up nothing much but food in here close this door just go ahead and look through every everything just to make sure the only thing i can see is this the small rocks that's pretty much it use this for base building later down the road pretty important i think they broke the door or they're breaking the door so we're going to go ahead and uh, just activate this quest, reset everything. I think the zombies are going to stay, so we're definitely going to have to kill them, obviously. Oh, you hit me, mister. I was expecting you to be able to do that. And I missed you. Now you're not dead. Not dead. He dodged the crap out of me. As soon as I was with the hit, he went low. He went low and I went high. That's nuts. Go ahead and close that door. I think I hear a bird somewhere, but we're just going to go right back to the exact same room. Pass up all these zombies. They really can't do much to us because this section right here is closed off. So we're going to do all that. We got one zombie to defeat up here. This little guy. What is it? We have a fetch quest. We can go ahead and complete the fetch quest as well. I don't see a reason why not. I mean, we're here. We got a shotgun. Okay, we got a double barrel shotgun. That's not bad. We have like 200 or something shotgun bullets already at the crib. So that's definitely a W right there. We're definitely going to be using that. 100% going to be using that uh, during the raid or not the raid, but during the... Um, during the uh da, 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 da. during during the, the the seven days of die horrible hellish time okay we're definitely gonna be using that so that's kind of a w right there already got something nice nice little double barrel shotgun level one but better than nothing now i just need to choose where i want to uh where, where are we going to go now we need like a decent house that house right there doesn't seem too bad i think we hit that house and then hit the house behind it those houses seem pretty small so i don't really want to go in there but i believe there's a basement in there you see that area right there looks like a basement i feel like we have maybe time for two more hits and that's really about it it's already 1600 it's really close to 2200 and that's about the time that this freaking seven days of death actually activates so we're gonna hit these two houses maybe even one i'm not sure if we're gonna have enough time um probably oh what's this is that a basement area definitely a basement area basement area is kind of scare me because there's a lot of zombies but then again at the same time there's a lot of loot all right we got a little dog we could definitely deal with him without uh finding ammo two hits to the dome he's done and we are knocked out. Do we have any meds on us? We're going to go ahead and use this just so we can use that um, just real quickly. Look, crawler. We could deal with him. One hit to the dumb. You're dead. Let me see. Let me see what's in here. So the entrance was through the basement, which means that the good loot isn't in the base. Oh, OK. We got a level six pipe. Not the best. I mean, it is a pipe at the end of the day, but it is level six. I'm not sure if I should use the double barrel shotgun or the pipe shotgun. I mean, it's a level six versus a level one, but double barrel, bro. It's a double barrel. You feel me? What's in here? Um, Pretty much nothing except this. Anything good? We got some nails. Nails are actually good for storage. I can make the big boy storage with that, which is really nice. You're too far in my way, so I gotta kill you. Uh, nothing in there but a bathroom. Not really gonna worry about that. Zombie in here? No. I'll take some time on this. Not really worth it, I don't think. So the loot is definitely upstairs. Definitely 100% upstairs. Doesn't seem like there's anything in that room. Unless, at least I thought, maybe there is something in that. I thought that was a bathroom. Two bathrooms? There's a door right here, though. Here's the lootage. Here's the lootage. We got three zombies in here. This is definitely where the loot is. Go ahead and take you out. One hit to you and you should be dead and you should be dead go ahead and close that door just so i don't see any zombies coming through the loot's definitely in here 100 w with a zombie go ahead and take you down thank you mr sir i appreciate that let me get some good loot let me get something good we got some ammo you know ammo is not bad but i really need a gun here unlock storage safe got an ak which is nice but we don't have any bullets to use the ak i might even scrap it i think i got me a level 2 ak anyways just to save some space bro we might actually yeah we're gonna scrap this uh we're gonna scrap the ak go ahead and eat the food here go ahead and eat the jar honey just because we can what's the time looking like 1700 we still got some time left 
So let's go ahead and loot that. Uh, I'm looking for a quick way out of here. So I mean, I don't think I should uh, go back the way I came. We're just gonna we're just gonna break through this. Probably gonna take a little bit, but we definitely do have time for the second house, which is really really nice. I could probably crash through here, right? 1700 second house. This house took what like an hour, pretty much like an hour. So yeah, I think we, I think we're dang. This lamp is 500. Oh my god. All right, we'll just we'll just go this way then. We'll just go this way. I don't see any zombies knocking on that door yet, so we should still be good. All right, cool, 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 cool. I don't even know where the second house was, bro. Look how foggy it is out here. I don't even know where the second house location. I don't even know where my. Okay, that's the raid. That's the raider. Okay, I mean a trader, not raider. That's the trader. I know that for a fact. I'm I'm just gonna get on my bike here. We need to find a second house. Um, is it this one? No, no, no. That was a flat story. Honestly, bro, we might we might as well just rate this flash story. Like, it doesn't it doesn't even matter at this point. I don't want to like spend too much time, and it's got a basement in there. So let's go ahead and uh, we're just gonna rate this flash story. It, it can't be that bad, right? At the end of the day, it, it can't be that bad. Hopefully, we get a pistol. That's what I'm really hoping for right now. It's just a nice uh, a nice little pistol. I don't really care about that. Actually, I might care about that because I can't even get through here. Yeah, yeah. It's just like they want us to fall. There's no thing in here. Yeah, they definitely want us to fall down here. I don't know if I want to fall down there, though. Should I just destroy this? Like this right here? Yeah, let's just do that. Hello, sir. You're making way too much noise. I got to take you down, brother. I got to take you down. One more, one more. Thank you. Go ahead and close the door as well. All right, we're not going to go the way they want us to go. We're going to go the way we want to go because we know where the loot is. We actually don't know. Where the, I have no, no idea where the loot is, but I know it's somewhere, somewhere in here. So if we were to go down there, we would have failed. Obviously, we would have to come back up, which means that the loot is probably upstairs. And upstairs is right here. Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? I might be correct. I might be. There's a chance that I am absolutely correct. As soon as I kill him, I expected him to die in the first hit or at least fall down. Not to just keep standing up. Yep, I was correct. I was correct. We might have time for one more. We might be pushing our luck with that one more, especially, but uh, we, we there's there's a chance we have one more. I can already feel my character bogging down because obviously my freaking inventory is completely filled with a bunch of stuff. Uh, right now, I don't think we need gas cans right now. That's not that's not a that's not a good sound at all. I'm going to drink the coffee, get rid of the cloth because we're just not going to use it right now. I'm drinking both coffees just because why not? Go ahead and scrap those, uh, keep those on me. Don't really need the blueberries. Why than that? That clear up a little bit of stuff. What is it? Steel tools and machine gun. Definitely going to keep the machine gun parts. Very, very important. Uh, the only thing that murky water, go ahead and drop you. I think that's pretty much it. Hopefully there's something good in these. Leather lead armor? I actually don't know. I don't even know what armor. Yeah, we're definitely not using the leather armor. Going ahead and keep my armor. We're definitely not using the leather armor when I got a level six scrap armor, bro. With, uh, with, with slots on it already. We don't even need the insulating. Go ahead and eat the tuna. Didn't really get much of anything good in here, unfortunately. Really big downer. However, we do have time for one more house, and we're going to take the time to do that one more house. Wherever that house is going to be, I've got no idea. But it was 1800 I need to have some time to get home and actually settle down and everything. Can I crouch jump up here? I doubt it. We're just going to break our way. I, I don't have time. I don't have time, bro. I'm, I'm low-key rushing, bro. I'm high-key high key of the lowest of the keys of the rushing right now, okay? So we definitely don't have time. 100% don't have time. One more of these, and we should be good. Um, ooh. Is that the trader house? Or is that just like a random... Can I crouch? Okay. Is that a rent? That's not the trader's house, right? We should go there. Yeah, let's go here. Why not? It's got a whole school bus and everything. Hopefully there's something here. I mean, there's a school bus here. What's inside the school bus? Come on, school bus. Let me get like a, I don't even know. Let me get a fire axe. That's what I really need. Okay, we got some more nails. I can't complain about the nails. I do like nails. I think the good loot is actually in here, if I'm not mistaken. She actually scared me. I didn't know she was over there. Come on, fall down for me. Go ahead and die. Thank you so much. Yeah, I think this is the only good loot on here. We might actually be going to another, another spot, bro. Another, another spot. It's only 1,800. We, we should start really rushing uh, once, um once 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 it's 2k i feel like that's when we really should start rushing once it's 2k once 2k hits we we need to be home because i believe this is the only thing left in here that and i think there's yeah there's something upstairs she's gonna go ahead and fall down oh wow i didn't expect her to hit me while she was coming upwards that's a surprise let me see what you got in here ah nothing much in there anything in here same thing bro same thing 
Let's go ahead and uh, uh we'll scrap that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Scrap that. And get rid of that. I don't want to be. I don't want to be heavy. That's the only thing right now. I don't want to be heavy. Bro, I've never even seen this before. Two millimeter ammo. Kind of nice. Oh, there's two of you. All right. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I can take you on. I could. Did he just dodge me? That's crazy. On. Oh, I'm getting hit way too much. Please, guys. Please, please, please. I'm trying to live before the raid comes. What is this? Robotics turn? I'll take that and I'll take that as well. I think both of those could be kind of nice. Can I make this jump? Oh, yes, we can. Massive W. One more. One more. Question mark. One more. Oh, we got some frames. All of that's kind of good. We're going to get rid of the oil. We're going to get rid of this. It's just stuff we don't really need right now. It's important stuff. Don't get me wrong, but I don't want to be heavy and I don't know what else to get rid of right now. Like that. We don't need that. We don't need that. I'm um, definitely going to keep the blocks to keep everything that I see pretty much for the most part and get rid of that 10 millimeter we need a little bit more what i'm really hoping for is a pistol though that's the main thing i'm hoping for now we got time for one more house and i believe it's going to be this house it's got a it's got a car it's already broken into there's a wolf on my left side i think we're going to go ahead and loot the car um and then just go through the front door i mean the front door is pretty much already open for the most part we should get done with this by 2k and then once 2k hits we go straight home all right straight home Go ahead and set up for everything and we should be good since we entered from the bottom i'm thinking that the loot is probably somewhere up here at the top like the very top or whatnot nothing in there i might be completely wrong though nothing uh nothing in here interesting am i completely wrong is the loot at the bottom no way right nothing in here um excuse me where's the loot it has to be at the top right am i wrong the loot has to be at the top, right? What if I, uh, can I, can I make that jump? Uh, okay. Um, I guess this is it. I can't, I don't know. I mean, like where else, where else could the loot be? I don't know. I guess that was it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't feel like looking around for that one. At least I don't feel like looking around. I'm going to make my way back to the trader. And on my way to the trader, we're going to try to raid one more thing on the way to the trader. Cause he's 4k Roy. So, I mean, 400. He's 400 away, which is pretty much our base. We need to go this way anyway. So, we find, like, a nice house that looks kind of scrumptious. Nah, 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 nah. Not like that. Not like that. Not like that. We need something different, bro. We need something different. Like, a nice one level. Something I can sweep through within, like, the next five minutes tops, okay? Something like that. Yeah, something like this right here. I like this on my left. Ooh, ran out of stamina too fast. Maybe not even. This one's got a freaking... The door's wide open on this one. Let's do this one. Let's do this one. The door is wide open. Why not? Why not, bro? We might be able to find like a pistol in here. Hopefully, probably not. But I mean, it's worth a shot, right? I think the loot's to the left up here. Yeah, right in here. Oh, it's empty. I've already been in here. I'm no wonder there's no zombies in here, bro. I'm, I'm a freaking nut, bro. I probably broke that down and everything just to get us out of there. More than likely. It's already 2K, so we got two minutes left. But I mean, we're 200 away. I'm hoping we can find one more thing. Let me see if I looted this. Nope. Can I get a fire axe? A fire axe would be amazing right now. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Ooh, ma'am, ma'am. It's my bike, ma'am. You hit me with, I'm on my bike. That's not actually not bad. SMG, uh, SMG schematic along with the motion sensing the schematic. Both of them could be used together pretty much. So our house is right there. I'm still wanting to raid one thing. I don't know what that one thing is going to be though. I'm thinking we just go over here. And go to this house. This house looks nice. Okay, we're gonna raid this house. All right, we're gonna we're gonna raid this house. I see something on the left side that allows me to get to the second story quickly, which is this right here. So hopefully this is the way that we're supposed to go, right into here. And then uh, this is the garage. Pretty much nothing in the garage most of the time. Um, nothing in there. That's one thousand. Definitely not gonna be able to break that down. There's got. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Loot's definitely up there right 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 no way out there no way out there how do we get up there um i think i see it i think i see it boom boom jump ah almost made it almost made it this has to be it though right okay okay i'm gonna have to place a frame now yeah here we go there we go there we go right there is where the loot is come on come on we can make it all right we got to answer from this side then it seems um maybe a little crouch action and then break these down there we go there we go 
and it's freaking empty okay forget it forget it forget it i don't know why was that empty forget it bro forget it we're going back home we're going back home we're going back home obviously the freaking house next to me would be occupied and, and freak not really occupied it's freaking empty what am i talking about obviously the house next to my base will be empty where's my house anyways isn't it over here okay 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 i see it i see it i see it we're good we're good all right so we're gonna set up shop and get ready for the seventh days of death okay that's what we're getting ready for right now our base is pretty pretty much solid we got the sledgehammer turret we got the shotgun which is nice hella shotgun bullets which is even better we didn't get a pistol so we're not gonna be able to use the pistol bullet sadly but everything else you know what i mean we, we should be good you know what i mean we should be good going ahead and put pretty much everything that i see in here i'm gonna learn that because why not because I'm doing that, I might as well learn the uh, motion sensor schematic as well. I'm going to put all of this up, put the water up, all of this. None of this really matters. I don't know if I should use a double barrel to pipe, to be honest. I feel like the double barrel just because of like, bow, bow. You know what I mean? And we got 123 shotgun shells, which is pretty nice. I'm going to put that up. I think that's all that could fit in there. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, do we have any health stuff on us? Maybe keep the coffee for stamina once we're doing a melee. Some food, uh, some bandages. All of that seems to be pretty pretty solid stuff. Uh, put you away, and I think we're ready. Yeah, for the most part, I think I think we're good, bro. I think we're good. Got ten of those. We probably do need to repair that. That's you know that's that's a given. Repair you, and yeah, I'm ready, bro. I'm ready. We're gonna do this next episode. Tune in, tune in, my good friends. Tune in.